Greetings, Cosmos, and welcome back to uh, a second Mario Brothers X thing, too. So, I'm just gonna start in the archive and see where things go from here. Let's see. I already did this one. Wait a hot minute. Can't enter this because it's not ready yet. Alright, let's start at the top right. Trading card collection. Meh. Glossary. Armageddon. One, an apocalyptic scenario. One B, the act of committing apocalypse or the person committing it. Three, two, an overwhelming amount of something. Three, a pilotable machine embodying the concept of rampage. See also destroy the world. So yeah, in a uh, Shimagami Tensei Four, in one of the endings, a character mentions waging Armageddon. A demo. Now, abbreviation of demonstration, specifically to reassure peers that the thing you did that seems like a mistake was absolutely definitely intentional totally probably not to be confused with the abcd demo beef steak a highly popular meat dish on some planets dodging is considered by some to be a fun and safe recreational activity correctional pulse correction pulse now a phenomenon that occurs in the process of space-time attempting to resolve paradoxes and other anomalous occurrences such as more than one instance of a person existing in the same universe those near the epicenter of the pulse may experience discomfort, disorientation, disassociation, and or hallucinations of being dissed. Destroy the world and everything inside. Figuratively, the act of causing immense amounts of destruction is literally committing Armageddon. Diapason? A burst of sound. Diapasons of laughter. The principal foundation stop and the organ extending through the complete range of the instrument. The entire compass of musical things. Range scope registers the full diapason of her responses. Tuning fork, standard of pitch. The gar Green Garlic Cult, a small collection of splinter sects that tends to grow in the shadows where the leek or orthodoxy and spring onionism don't. Each of them tend to have different opinions about on what a green garlic actually is and how it is better than the other veggie, but they are so spread out that there's barely any consensus. Our own scientific studies into it have revealed the spatial, section-like nature of the green garlic, but we are unsure whether any of the green garlic cultists have discovered the same thing. Laundromat! A mythical location rumored to be where clothes are laundered. To where or whom they are laundered is rarely ever specified in the legends. Okay, I like that one. The Leek Orthodoxy. An organized monotheistic religion that considers the Leek the ultimate vegetable. Adherents construct temples in honor of their omniscient goddess, Lady Leek. We chronotons aren't ones for superstition, but considering leaks are integral to our work, we do our best to maintain good relations with the Orthodoxy Church and have built a leak pedestal resembling the ones in their sanctuaries to accommodate visiting followers. The Melody A mysterious phenomenon experienced by roughly two out of every 15 people in the known universe. Those affected by it, referred to as the attuned, are said to experience continuous music that changes based on their surroundings and other contexts. Though attuned in similar locations and situations that before they heard the same music playing in perfect sync. Religions have been formed around the phenomenon, with the belief that the melody protects those who frequently thank it. There are even stories that the melody is sung by a being of perfect neutrality as old as time itself. I is that the explanation for why there's background music? Not a thing that needed explaining, but sure! Spring Onionism A comparatively small or semi-organized religion that split itself from the leek orthodoxy. Not monotheistic, but rather polytheistic, just like a spring onion has several stalks while a leek has only one. Spring onionism such a, as such sees many deities besides Lady Leek, but some groups even see Lady Leek as a usurper of power, trapping them in a worse existence. Ultimately, they don't tend to deal with this chronotons because spring onions have spiritual, layer-like properties, not temporal, event-like ones that leeks do. Rao Cowology. Simply put, it's a thing. Okay. Now, I'm going to pause the recording and you can join up with me on the map. And welcome back. Pausing the recording is a powerful tool that I should learn to use more often. Mountain Descent by S.A. Jews. So yeah, literally descending the mountain. I like how much work they put into making the map match with the levels. They didn't have to, but it is awesome. I am great at landing on things. Let's see here. Okay, for a second I thought I was actually going to get hit by that. Alright. Ugh. Oh, jumps too high. 
Okay, there we go. And... Whee! Oh, well. Huh. There's something on, uh, on the edge here. Interesting. Huh. Are these being caused to jump by the presence of the other one, or are they just deciding to... I don't know what went on there, but that's cool. Slide! Okay, that might have a power-up in it, and so I will graciously accept it. Slide! Okay, got the uh, second rail coin. Go through the door. And bop! Hmm. You know, I once had an awful nightmare about a sonic level taking place in an area like this, but there was more water and less wind. Oh, I may have made a mistake. Okay, so, doop, and whoosh. Okay, so, pop up here. Is there a uh, reason to go up here? Is there some kind of secret here? There is! Right above where the lone coin was. And finding that secret is quickly rewarded. Mountain crabs. Okay. I'm gonna grab another power up so I don't die in one hit. Oh. I appreciate this. Okay. All right. Wait, hold on. Okay. Blue stage. Blue stage. This level is canned by Raukow. Oh, Raukow himself made a level for this. Neat. I am bad at his levels. I have played a few of them before. I am bad at them. Demo has... A, fence saint, a faint scent of cinnamon. Iris smelled like garlic. Neat. Wait, better check and see if there's a secret pipe at the top of this thing. Okay, nope. Demo is left footed. When Artificial Time Excess got cancelled, Sheath was supposed to be erased like the rest of the comics world. However, her ability to forget her injuries or death kicked in as she popped back into existence. The laws of causality then tried to place her in another world that resembled her old and most resembled her old one. Neat. Okay. I was trying to shoot a fireball upward, but sure. I accept this. Pop. Wild Goopas and Goopas created by Garish and Slime are separate things. Okay. Oh. Okay, I'm not doing this correctly. Besides, I could just do this. Why am I trying to wait for a bullet to jump on? ABCDs are able to sleep but don't require it to function. Interesting. Aha! Oh, hey, dog. It costs roughly 20 million gold coins to make one batch of six ABCDs. Neat. Pan. Sniff. Pan. Wow. Whoop. Oh, that is interesting that you can dig up a... Whoop. ABCDs age, but like jellyfish, they will not die from old age. Anyway, I was saying a thing, and now I forget what I was, what sentence I'd even start. Oh well. 
ABCDs have no internal organs other than the brain. The rest of the body is filled with a fluid that doubles as a nervous system and a means to transfer oxygen to the brain. Air is filtered directly through their skin. So are nutrients. Neat. Also terrifying. Oh yeah, it's neat that the dog can dig up, uh... Things. Sniff. 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 Hand. Sniff. Sniff. Because it's Raukouts, the, the reward Whoa. isn't in the middle. Anyway, what was I saying? Yeah, yeah, it's neat that the dog can dig up plants. Okay, so then. Wait for shots to be fired. Great jumping. Okay, so. Bounce! Yes, finally. ABCDs are born hairless and legless. The legs typically grow after around two Earth years. Neat. Oh. Oh. Nobody understands yet why absorbing some nutrients gives ABCDs temporary mutations and powers. The many ways that ABCDs can break the laws of physics is actually worrying. I thought there might be a power up here, and I'm glad I was right. Oh, the dog didn't elevate. ABCDs have access to all the five senses, even though they, even though the lack necessary organs. They also talk without having a mouth. Nobody knows how, why, or how. Well, there's a character in the Owl House that makes me think of armless bipedal. Uh oh. Cycloptic demons. A time to dissect an ABCD will just make its body disappear into dust. After several seconds, it will respawn alive and well. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, what? Not an advanced power up? I make good decisions. I make good decisions. I make the good decisions. All right, let's try that again. Oh wait, no, I don't have a dog anymore. I am filled with all of the sadness. All eight of it. All right, wait for shots to be fired and then boom. And then place this here so I can do this. Great jumping. Just the best of it. Okay. ABCDs are subject to something called specialization. Basically, as an ABCD gets older, its body will alter itself so that it can more easily accomplish whatever task it was given. Mutations can get quite severe. After a certain age, they will not be able to absorb power-up anymore, but they have access to strange physics-defying abilities of their own. Whoa. Hey, is there something up there? Like, I feel like those two coins indicate a secret. Decision-making prowess. Back here. Hi ya. Alright. Acquire some food. So yeah, I'm just gonna leave that. I'm just gonna leave those two coins alone. Okay. Up. 
Okay. Smash. Oh, hold on. Alright, so. I must know. It would probably be for the best if I, uh, did not pursue this. Yeah, there's nothing up there. Just two coins. Okay. ABCs can easily respond, but they still don't appreciate getting shot at. Eventually, Demo will gain the ability to create copies of herself. This was first seen in that one level of ASMBXT. She, she will be instrumental in the second great ABCD extinction. Oh, nice. I like this. So anyway, that one uh, ASMBXT level was a level that asked you to touch... To type in a cheat, Super B Demo 128, also a Super Mario 128, in order to create a million copies of Demo. Or Iris, if you happen to be playing as Iris at the time. So, cast this into the abyss, toss this upward, toss this upward, wait for shots to be fired. Okay. Oh. Okay, so, bop. Hop. Power up. Okay, so wait for shots to be fired and then smash that. Oh, ho, ho, I am sad now. Okay. Wait until that begins its ascent and then hop on it. Okay. Iris' specialization has already started. It is passive and she is unaware of it. She can copy the power of other ABCD when they are in close proximity for long enough. In addition, other beings also share this temporary copying effect. This is why Raukau, Kud, and Sheath are affected by power-ups. But I thought Kud came from another game where... Whatever. I'm not going after that Rao coin. I've died too many times in this level already. Okay. Oh, interesting. That is not... That level over there is not where the paths meet. I'll have to do that level next time. Join me then.